Hey guys, it's Red Hood 420. We're here to talk about some news for Batman Return to Arkham. And I'm going to talk about two things. The possible release date for Batman Return to Arkham collection. This collection is supposed to come out November. We all know it was delayed indefinitely. But now they're hoping to release this on November. But the main reason for delaying it, and I quote, this is from Eurogamer and they have sources that told them this that the reason that the game was delayed was because the frame rate issues which gets me disappointed about this collection because it had a backlash it wasn't because of the frame rate it was because of the graphics and how worse it looked from the original so Warner Bros don't care about our criticisms for the trailer they're just like no we just need a stable frame rate and that's good that's good and all a stable frame rate is great you know it makes the game not broken and it's a requirement but you guys don't care that this looks worse at instances than the original game this makes me not want to buy this collection and it makes it me just it just makes me want to keep playing on the pc and i have the pc version and it looks better than the ps3 and 360 version and it runs at 60 fps or more so I don't understand what this studio is doing. I don't understand what Warner Bros. is doing. You know, everyone can defend this remastered, but I'm not buying it. I have a PC version, and I'm going to play that. It just doesn't make sense. Why are we having Batman look constipated? Why are we having instances where Hugo Strange doesn't look great? Doesn't look like the original counterpart of his in Batman Arkham City. I just don't understand <laughs> what they're doing there you have the criticisms from the fans take the criticisms delay it make it look better make it look on par with batman arkham knight and it isn't i <laughs> warner bros if you're listening to this listen to the fans make the graphics better i watched a couple of slick moth videos and he was hoping for better graphics and stuff like that and that's not the case you just don't care Warner Bros. is hoping that we're just going to not care about graphics being there. That the game is stable, so they're not going to get the backlash of a broken game. But guess what? They're going to get the backlash for the graphics. I hope all the fans will make a noise about this and say, Why are you going to give us a game that looks worse than the original games? I don't understand what they're doing there. Why can't they get it through their thick heads that this game... That they're trying to say that they're going to make it Arkham Knight level graphics. But it's not. It's worse than the original. Come on, Virtuous Studios. You can do better than this. Delay this game even more. I don't care. Make it on par with Arkham Knight. So we can have that level of fidelity of graphics. That we can move and transition into Batman Arkham Asylum, Arkham City, and Knight. And this makes it a smooth transition when going into it. If someone hasn't played the Arkham games, they get the same level of graphics and it'll be, it's a big wow factor. Like, oh my gosh, this game, this series looks so amazing, but that's not gonna happen because they don't care. They rather have people saying that this game looks bad, but at least the game's not broken. <sighs> Man, I just hope they do that because the main complaint from everyone were the graphics and they're just concerned with the FPS, which FPS is a main requirement. So you should have had this delayed even from the get-go when knowing that. But the main complaint was the graphics, and we're not going to get them. And I'm very sad about that. And I'm not going to buy this collection because it doesn't offer me anything. So it is what it is, guys. But this is just, you know, from Eurogamer. So take this with a grain of salt. It could be true. Most likely it is, to be honest. But tell me your thoughts on this news about this potential release date and the reason for delaying it. Do you guys want to buy this collection? Do you not want to buy this collection? Are you a PC gamer so you don't think you're going to buy this collection like I'm not going to because I'm also a PC gamer and PS4 gamer? Let me know in the comment section below. Guys, I hope you're having a great day. Share this video with your friends. Give this video a like. And if you like my content, you know what you should do? Hit that subscribe button. Helps me out. Helps yourself out. You know, <laughs> I'm just kidding. I mean, it just helps me out, to be honest. But, uh, yeah, it is what it is. This is Red Hood 420, signing off.